Finally, after six months of working and using all of Sam's more than 10 years of photo editing experience, Sam has successfully researched and developed FineArt's secret image editing software. Sam put the whole process into this plugin and from there it increased Sam's image editing speed by 5 to 10 times. In this tutorial, Sam will guide you through editing a photo taken at San Francisco City Hall. Then this photo is that many of you wonder why Sam took such a dark photo. Sam photographed so dark to let Sam retain the details of these lights. If I take a photo, the light will lose detail. Sam will demo show you that if I take photos in the right light, then these lights will lose detail. And I will be very difficult and almost impossible to save in post-production. That's why Sam always shoots underexposure. You need to understand this issue carefully in the post-production. Because the burnt part one can't save, and the dark part one can easily save. Then this photo as well as Sam's previous instructions show you. First I will balance this image by geometry. I choose auto. I pulled the picture up a little bit. Already. Then the pole, the columns it has stood on are over, it's beautiful. Then I choose open, then I have a picture like that. Now I will process it again by cropping the image. Then Sam wanted to keep this watch face as an important detail of the photo. So I don't need this part. Then Sam will drag the picture. Pull the skirt down. In this picture I can do the following actions. In order to lengthen the body without affecting the picture, Sam will pull this picture lower. This upper part is low. Then Sam will pull the whole picture up. Now I can lengthen the bride's legs. Now these parts will be zoned. And I shift delete. Photoshop's AI is very smart. Later versions it will do the job automatically. Then if this part is too far, I can drag it. This photo is a little over here. Let it go away. Then I dragged this picture over here a little bit. Let it go away. Before, after. People will not understand why I took such a straight angle. Right? When I take a super wide angle, it will be, original picture it will look like this. Next, now I will process the color of this photo. First, Sam will brighten this part of the skin. By the way Sam will add 0.3 stops. Now Sam will add until Sam finds enough. Sam sees that is okay. Then you see that after I increase a lot, this part of the light is burned. It won't be pretty. Because when shooting in architecture, there are lights that are the most annoying details. If I don't handle it well, my picture will be brushed. So now Sam has to shoot at night. And now Sam will group all these layers together. Sam will create a mask and Sam will scan the recovery. After you see is when Sam scans in. Then this light is back to the way it was. Very detailed. Now that Sam wants something dark, Sam scans that part. If only I didn't want it to be too dark. Then I reduce the opacity to 50%. Starting off, I will scan in the parts that I want. 
let it darken. The most important thing is that Sam wants to keep the details of the lights. Before. After. Already. Now I can choose the fine art color. So here Sam has a ready-made fine art color. This photo is indoor arts. I will click here. I will have a color. That's it. Now Sam restores the color on the subject. By having Sam scan the subject. I don't want the yellow dress, so now Sam sweeps the subject. Do not sweep into the dress. And Sam will restore these lights. Sam doesn't want these lights to lose their color, it won't be pretty. Before, after. I have a very impressive color. Skin is a bit dark, so Sam will lighten it up a bit. I merge all layers. Finally, I choose skin, white skin 3. And I sweep into the bride's skin. Skin will be brighter. Then if you want even brighter, you can choose again. The color is quite nice. Now Sam next is Sam handling the dress. I will merge all layers. Back then, I always did the subject part. And the color part. Because the color I use preset. Before, after. Now I will create a new layer. Duplicate the layer up. Sam will click on liquify. Sam will squeeze the skirt. Okay now Sam will work on the dodge and burn part for the details to emerge. The first is that Sam will dodge. Sam will light it up. This lamp Sam also wanted it to stand out more. Textures. Note that not everywhere I hit. I have to choose the highlights for my photo. Before, after. Next, Sam will hit the skirt. First, Sam will hit the ribs of these skirts. Then Sam will burn. This upper part is a little darker. Because the top of the dress is a bit light. We noticed burn. Before, after. Before, after. This picture you can make it stand out even more. By selecting this detail. Now it will add details to the photo. Before, after. Do you see the photo it stands out more? If you don't want the skin to be affected too much. Then I will zoom into this skin. I scanned it out. Here Sam subtracts 80%. 
Also, now I can make this dress whiter. Now I will merge this layer together. I'll make the dress whiter. By the way, I'll go in. White dress. Trắng nè, white dress. À, Just để to quét scan the dress. Thôi á, thì Sam Then Sam will change the mask. mask là Command I or Control I. Now Rồi, Sam will have the brush. And Sam, Sam will sweep the dress. I'm going to change this brush color to white on top, black on bottom, and now I'm going to paint on the dress. You see now it only affects the dress. It does not affect the surrounding environment. Before, after. Then I can Mình lower the opacity if I think the dress is a bit white. Lại opacity nếu mình thấy cái váy nó hơi trắng. And Rồi. now I see that if this top color and this bottom color are different, what should I do? Now Sam, Sam will select this brush. brush Sam, Sam will select the brush, brush color. color. Click on Click it. Vào. Then Thì before doing this, làm cái này I will merge the layer together. Nha, I chose the Rồi, brush color. Chọn cái brush color. I will mình press option or alt. I chose the color đó. above. Mình chọn cái màu phía trên này. Click, Click to choose a color. Then I will scan below. Và phía dưới. That means mình I'm đang taking the color above. Này, I'm scanning the bottom. Make the dress more even. Hơn. Before, after, it's the same color as the dress. The dress before I scanned the color, the bottom part was a bit yellow, now it's even. Show you, I have adjusted the color image in the block to be more irregular, the details are more prominent. Here is the color treatment. Then you can continue to select brush plus detail. If you want to increase the detail of a part of the photo, I will scan it. For example, this part you want to be brighter, the light wants to be brighter, then I can choose this detail section. Or the dress. If you want it to be sharper, then you choose to scan the parts you wanted to increase detail. But I didn't scan the whole picture. Sam's post-production is mainly focused on handling small details. My limitation is to do on the whole photo. Since it will be even, it doesn't have 3D, blocky. My fine art quality is that it will be on every detail. Then I can choose more contrast. These brushes are very important. Before you brush, you must group it. Group it. Then I just created a brush called contrast. I added contrast. For these dark areas it is more pronounced. I finished the photo. This is before. While shooting Sam kept the details of these lights, after Sam increased the light. And color correction, these lights still retain detail. Then I block on the photo, it's more vibrant, more impressive.